thank God for another day. All right, thank you, Lord. And he has spared us and brought us to the house of prayer once again. All right. Truly, this is a good day. All right. Amen. No matter what's going on, it's still a good day. All right. Somebody ought to lift them hands and just tell God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you. All right, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
What make a person do that? Satan. Yeah. Yeah. An evil spirit. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. I told God I'm going to thank you. All right. Amen. Get it out of my mind. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. I say that to try to make you think evil. Uh -huh. Hey, you looking at other people crazy? Yeah. All yeah. right. Uh -huh. Come on. Uh -huh. And them folks ain't even thinking about you. Yeah. Lord, get the evil out of my mind. All right. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. And let me tell you something. You rebuke Satan, he comes back. He sure does. Sometimes it don't take him off. All right. Yeah, but you got to keep rebuking that job. Why did we stop? teachers and false preachers and things to prepare us to know how they operate mm -hmm. because these false teachers and, and, and false preachers they are pulling a lot of people away from the church because of what they are telling him everything that go into your ear that sounds good doesn't mean it's good mm -hmm. because Satan will give you a good piece of meat or bread and then you fall for it, and when he started doing it, he started adding more and more. But God lets us know that he's a jealous God. He wants us to love him mm -hmm. and not Satan. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it goes to that scripture where Satan is trying to build his kingdom above God's kingdom. But before God allowed that, he'll turn stones into souls. And I was thinking about that, and I was like, you know, I don't want him to turn a stone into a soul. I want him to get my soul. Mm -hmm. Because it, it, it's showing and it's teaching a lot, but we have to take heed to it. And, and when we know something that is not right, you shun the very appearance of evil. Shun it. Get away from it. Yeah, because yeah, he's, <coughs> he's giving us what we need. It's up to us to accept him or to reject him. But my choice is to continue to accept him because Satan is, Satan, he's on his job and he, he's getting worse and worse. Like you're saying, he, 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 he's, he's growing angrier and angrier because it's not going as fast as he wanted to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But we have to be aware of these things. Amen. Amen. Ooh. And before you look, they got the rides and storms and Everything happened. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. They're talking about uh, uh, the, the, the heat wave that's coming and all that kind of stuff. Listen, you can't stop that. No. Right. No. What, what brought it about? It wasn't gasoline and all that stuff. It's sin. Sin. Right. Mm -hmm. Sin. Sin. But people don't want to hear that. They don't. Yeah. They don't, they don't want to hear that. Have an eyes full of doctrine that cannot cease from what? Sinning. Cease from sin. Amen. Beguiled, enticed, mm -hmm. unstable soul. You better get as close to God as you can. Mm -hmm. All right. Learn as much about Him as you can so that nobody can fool you. Amen. They, 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 you know, they, they, there are people who go out and buy purses and stuff thinking they're getting the, uh, 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 the, the good stuff and it's just invitation. That's not the word, that's not what God, you know what I'm saying? 
Go ahead. There's a burning desire that you, that, that you pray for, so to say. It's a sin, covering it. Amen. You cover, cover for somebody else. Yeah. You know, you, 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 you desire what somebody else has. Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh, 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 and they they was they practice it. Then know what they said? They practice it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it wasn't something that just happened. They practice. All right. When you practice sin, that means you enjoy it. All right. Huh? Yeah, yeah. You, you enjoy it. You, you, you know, it don't bother you at all. Enjoy it. When I was out there, I enjoyed myself. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. You know, some folks lie. I came to God and I found out I didn't have nothing. I didn't enjoy it. Stop lying. Yeah. That's why I took God so long to get you from out there. No conscience. You got one, but it's 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 it's, it's, it's dull. It's dull. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. He put you in places to lure you. Yeah. He will put you in places to lure you. Amen. Don't 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 think the devil is crazy. He know what you're like. Uh -huh. Amen. He knows what you like. You know, somebody say like me with bow leg. Uh. <laughs> and, 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 and 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 before you know it, you're in the grocery store. Here, come on, bow leg. What is Satan trying to do? He's trying to lure you. Yeah. He's trying to lure you. And then I say to any woman, before you marry a man, check him out. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. If this credit is bad, you can have A1 credit, you marry him, your, your credit is bad. All right. If he ain't got nothing when you marry, he ain't gonna have nothing to the marriage. Uh -huh. Check him out. Well, women love them bad boys. Uh -huh. Yeah, they ain't got nothing. No, he got, don't even have a bicep. They got to drive your stuff. Live in your house. Uh -huh. And then tell you, I ain't paying no rent. My name ain't on this, but then get out. All right. Right. Oh, get out. You ain't paying nothing, get out. Don't stay there, ain't Check him out, make sure he wants something out of life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Other than sleep in all day. All right. While you work. Oh, no, man. <laughs> I, I, I just don't get it. I said to myself, some women are as bad as dumb. As a bat hanging upside down. Uh -huh. Okay, let's get over there. All right. That ain't no man. That's mm -hmm. Real men have pride in themselves. Right. I don't want no one to take care of me. Amen. I take care of my wife. Uh -huh. Amen. And there have been times that I run out of money and had to go to her and get a couple of dollars for gas. 
I hated to do that. Amen. All right. Even though I gave her the money. Uh -huh. You got to be a man. Uh -huh. Got to be a woman. Uh -huh. Know your value. Yes. Know who you are. Children to the side, and you take care of them. no good man. They got to answer to God for that. Yeah, but they don't see it like that. I love it. Amen. I saw her, 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 her one, nice. one woman and her boyfriend locked up because her girl was killed. Oh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, I forget how old she was. Well, you be careful who you let come in your house. Right. Yeah. Let's come in there and let them leave them there with their children while they're gone to work. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's the one I'm talking about. Y'all ain't getting it. All right, now. Yeah. 
The donkey stopped. It wouldn't go no further. Mm -hmm. He hit the donkey, and the donkey talked. All right. I'd have left that donkey a run. All right, now. Yeah. All right. All right. The donkey said, have I done what you asked me? Uh-huh. Always. <laughs> All right. So in other words, there's something stopping me. Yeah. Uh-huh. There ought to be something that will stop us yeah. from walking away from God. From leaving God. There ought to be something stop you. Just think about how good it been to you. Yeah. When I was in the world, the world was killing me, but he saved me. Uh -huh. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Oh, Lord, he brought me out of darkness into this marvelous light. So all right, I said, look where he brought me. But was rebuked for his what? Iniquity. The dumb ass. Thank you. With man voice. Forbid. Or restrained him. Uh -huh. The madness of what? The prophet. Uh -huh. First of all, how can you curse with God and bless? All right. You cannot curse what God has blessed. Look at somebody say, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. Can't nobody curse me. All right. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that ought to be some good news to somebody tomorrow. All right. Folk want you down. Folk want to see you out. Folk want to see you hollering and crying. But you can't do it to me because I'm blessed. All right. All right. And you cannot curse <laughs> what God has. In many ways, they tried to pull me down. Uh huh. But God wouldn't allow it. Oh, yeah. All right. Why? When you're blessed, can't nobody curse you. Uh huh. He's not keeping you. Uh huh. If he exalts you, can't nobody pull you down. All right, now. Yeah. Ooh, Lord, have mercy. All right. <laughs> Somebody say hallelujah. hallelujah. No matter what kind of tricks they try, no matter what they try to pull, they can't pull you down because you've been blessed and exalted by God. Amen. All right. Amen. Hmm. Verse These are wells without water, clouds that are carried with the tempest, to whom the mist of darkness is reserved forever. These are wells without water. They don't uh -huh. have the spirit. They don't have the Holy Spirit. Uh huh. He said, "They don't want anywhere I'll be in where a water springing up out of your belly uh -huh. shall flow rivers All right. of living water." Uh huh. Some of them are preaching and don't even know what they got about. All right. They done fixed up some stuff though. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> huh? All right. Amen. That's why those who are filled with the Spirit of God, their words don't bother them. Amen. It's those that are filled with the Spirit of God. When that word goes forth, it energizes you. It touches you. Because the word is powerful. Yes, right. Shopping in any two edged so The word, Lord have mercy, gives you strength. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Clouds that are carried away, carried with a tempest. Wind blowing. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, wind blowing. Uh -huh. It's cool with me. It ain't me. All right. It might blow me somewhere I don't want to go. All right. Uh -huh. Amen. So I got to be in control. Uh -huh. I got to allow God to be in control of my life. All right. 
people tell me sometimes, why don't you get out of that house? For what? Uh-huh. Everything I need is in the house. All right.
They think they can do anything. Uh -huh. And still make it. Amen. What is this? The sins. God done saved them. Uh -huh. He'll clean you up. Your flow been swept and garnished. Satan is out. Seeking a place of rest. Uh -huh. Then he comes back. Find your flow swept and garnished. But you didn't move nothing in. Uh -huh. you, didn't put, you didn't put no furniture in the living room. So the devil come and bring and put his furniture in there. Uh-huh. Oh, the floor's clean. Uh-huh. The walls and stuff are clean, but you didn't bring nothing to put in it. All right. Once God has saved you, pulled you out of the world, if you don't get the Spirit of God in you and the Word of God, the devil will come back and bring seven more. Uh-huh. Amen. And that person is in the worst state. Then at the beginning. Uh -huh. That's why it's harder to get back. Once you pull straight, it's hard. Uh -huh. It's harder to get back. And the pollution of the world through the knowledge of the Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ. You gotta learn something. You gotta learn something. Uh -huh. you gotta study. All right. You gotta study. When you're by yourself, you got to have that word in you. Uh -huh. I will never leave you. Neither will I forsake you. Uh -huh. You got to have that word in you. Amen. My enemy and my foe came upon me to yield my flesh. They stumbled. They fell. You got to have that word in you. All right. Fret not thyself because of evil news. Be be thy enemy. Of the workers of iniquity, but well, they shall soon be cut off. Yeah. Uh -huh. That's how the word Lord, when I fear, I trust thee, O Lord. Mm. Mm. <coughs> Are we having anybody? Yeah, no. Uh -huh. 
their worst state, they're in a worse state. So they do anything. So they commit suicide. Have you heard people be committing suicide now? Right. More than ever before. All right. It's exactly because they lose hope. Lose hope. Lose hope. When you go back out of that world, you don't lost hope. Uh -huh. Amen. I think uh, I got hope for, for, for further than on this earth. Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. That keeps me going. Uh -huh. Read.
right? I can trust him. All right. Every promise he made, I can trust him on it. Uh -huh. And so that was washed to her water again and all. Take a pee. Uh huh. Clean him up. Uh huh. Wash him. All right. Put a bowl on him. Uh huh. And turn your back. Uh huh. He'll be right back in that mood. Right back. Uh huh. All right. That pretty bowl you put on got a mood on it now. All right now. When we leave God, that's what it's like. Uh huh. Going back wallowing All right. in the mud. Uh huh. He's all we got. Yeah. And if you can't see that now, uh -huh. something's wrong. All right. Uh huh. You know, you know. I just want to say, you right. know, when people don't know that that's all you got, and they don't understand how we're being, I just say, because when they had that bad weather, everybody was called and texting me in Kiwi or not too long ago when they had the, the tornado, mm -hmm. not the tornado, whatever they were, the bad well, I thought he didn't even come near us. Mm -hmm. And that's just God protecting us. Yes. That's mm -hmm. just God's protection. Yes, and I keep telling you, he passed us again. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right. He's my friend when friend don't understand. He 
He's all I got. And as he delivered me from the problem of this world, I, I will not go back. I will not. I shall not. I hope not. I will not go back. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. All right. Uh, our scripture reading, 2 Peter chapter 2, verses 14 through 22, total present 11, and total offering 40 dollars. All right, it's good. Man, that's what can I hear? Second. It has been probably most of the sacrifice I've just read, man, if you receive and adopt it. All in favor, let me know about the Easter sign. All right? Aye. Hold the same sign. No questions or comments. Let's pray briefly for money service. Get right, church, and let go home. Get right, church, and let go home. Get right, church.
Lord, I know you can. I believe that you will this morning. Lord, build him up where he's been torn down. Lord, prop him on his leaning side. Lord, I know you can. And I believe that you will this morning. Lord, can we thank you for the study of your word this morning. Lord, let us apply your word to our life that we might become better Christians, our Father. Lord, can somebody sick and shut in this morning need not call them name by name for you know who they are and where they are this morning. Lord, be there all in all this morning. Lord, I know you can and I believe that you will this morning. Lord, can somebody read this morning, our Father, let them know that you made not a mistake this morning. Lord, give them strength to go through this too. Lord, I know you can and I believe that you will this morning. Lord, that we thank you for the study of your word, our Father. Amen. Lord, let us make our word your way to our lives, our Father, that we might become better Christians, our Father. Lord, that most of all, we thank you, Jesus, who unbled and on died on the young cross. Mm -hmm. The very day morning, he got up with all power in his hand. Lord, when it's your time to call and our now, so we know not when, we know not where, we can be the somewhere and a dying now. Lord, then give our soul the rest of the place. These are the other we ask in our son, Jesus. Amen. Amen. We may stand by responsibility and give him thanks to our Lord and our Savior for being here this morning. Our pastor, each one of you is present this morning. God is still a good God. He keeps blessing you and I over and over again. Not because we did good, but because he has been good. He keeps making a way out of no way for you and I. All right, our scripture this morning from 1 Corinthians. The 12th chapter, let us read the 18th through 25th verse that we make. First Corinthians, the 12th chapter, the 18th through the 25th verse. But now had God set the members, every one of them in the body, as it had pleased him. School. And they were all one of them, But now are the many members, yet but one body. School. And the eye cannot see. Nay, much more those much more those members who, of the body which seem to be more feeble are necessary, school. And those members of the body which remain to the best honor, of course we can restore more honor. And our common parts have more honor common. Well, our common part have no need, but God has tempered the body together, having given more upon the honor to that part that like it all. That there should be no schism in the body. And the members should have the same care for one another. All right, you may be seated. Again, we thank God for being back this morning. We thank God for our pastor. Thank God for you who has came out to be a part of all the study this morning. We realize that uh, all we got is our right now. We realize that we are living in critical time. Now, in the set of God's words, which is wrapped around the end time, uh, we realize that we are right in the midst of the end time. All the things that are going on now in our homes, our, in our communities, in our churches, uh, lets us know that we are right in the midst of the end time. In other words, violence seems to be running rapid this morning. In other words, men have no respect for other men's life. Men just soon to take another man's life and to speak to him. These are the times that we're living in. Every time you turn on your TV or your radio, you hear a cage where somebody has been killed, somebody's life has been taken from them. These are the times that we are living in. Men are enacting law to please themselves. These are the times that we are living in. Man is calling right wrong and wrong right. These are the times that we are living in. Because man is done so don't mean it is so. We realize and know that God will have the last say so. Only what we do for Christ will last. We also realize and know that till we live here are not wrapped up in Christ. We will spend eternity in hell. And hell is hot and eternity is a long time. No question, no comments. Let's be able to study with our pastor. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Oh, this little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine. Let it shine everywhere I go. I'm gonna let it shine. Oh, everywhere I go. I'm gonna let it shine everywhere I go. I'm gonna let it shine. Oh, 
shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. I ain't gonna make it shine, I'm gonna let it shine. Oh, I ain't gonna make it shine, I'm gonna let it shine. I ain't gonna make it shine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Jesus gave it to me. I'm gonna let it shine. Oh, Jesus gave it to me. I'm gonna let it shine. Jesus gave it to me. I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. 